What's up guys? I'm John. I'm Sharice. And I'm Thaddeus. Yes. AKA Titus O'Neill. <laughs> I didn't want to, let, to get them the chance to mess it up. You know, I want to make sure I'm introduced the right way. <laughs> and uh, we're here uh, to talk to our good friend Thaddeus um, about his travels, his lifestyle, and uh, how Titan therapies have helped him with all this improving quality of life and hopefully improving the different things that he's doing, whether it's helping his immune system on the road because uh, he's traveling all the way around. Um, he's got a, a grueling work schedule and he's still got to stay in shape and look the part as I know how that goes. Uh -huh. He's, doing it, though, right? yeah. he's yeah, definitely yeah. doing it, right? Yeah, looking good, and, looking uh, good. Uh, you know, you know <laughs> injuries, you know, getting over that and, and yeah. you know, doing that in a daily routine because those can be nagging too. And then at that point, you know, as we age, we still want to still stay young, right? Mm -hmm. And in uh, the inside on the outside. So we'll talk about some of that too as well. So let's just dive right into it. Sharice, you want to take the, the reins on this? Sure, sure. Um, so I would like to pass it over to Thaddeus here and, you know, kind of, I guess my first question, because obviously you do a lot of different things. You travel a lot. So, and you've been with us for quite some time now too. Um, so I'd like four, to know. Four years, five yeah, years. it's been a while. It's been a while. Yeah. It's been a while. Um, so I'd like to know, you know, uh, prior to you starting Titan Therapies to now, mm -hmm. what would you say your two top biggest things that you've noticed change wise as far as, and it could be anything mm -hmm. from, you know, whether it's physically, emotionally, mentally, um, what would you say like your two top ones that have been the most improvement? Um, I think two top improvements I've had. Number one, uh, I definitely have gotten more energy. Um, and I, I, when I came to you guys, I was really struggling with a lot of fatigue, being on the road a lot, working out, trying to balance, raising kids, etc., yeah. businesses. Um, I just it just felt drained a lot. And then being able to, to get start get, coming here and getting put on different therapies uh, gave me the opportunity to like start feeling a little different. But then like I was like, well, I'm, I'm not just like tired like I feel like I'm losing strength too mm -hmm. and I don't lift heavy anymore so mm -hmm. I had to try to find alternate ways to build strength build muscle build lean muscle and I couldn't do that just by going in and lifting weights I don't mm -hmm. have the desire to put 500 pounds on the bench <laughs> anymore. I'm trying to prove like that to nobody <laughs> yeah. um, so training differently um, and then nutrition uh, is not my skill set I mean anybody that follows me on Instagram <laughs> knows that like I I, I do I, I eat whatever I, I like I food. Love yeah, I love food. <laughs> yeah. So, um, and it's okay for you to love food. You gotta, yeah, you listen, you gotta enjoy uh, life. You gotta right? enjoy life. I, that's yeah. my biggest Some thing. Balance. Genetics, genetics help me out some, yeah. but definitely my Titan therapies help me out a lot yeah. more. Um, and I'll be able to get away with a little bit more than I probably should at, <laughs> at, at my age. Um, but I would tell anybody out there, like, uh, it, you know, you have to have proper supplementation. To go along with anything you do, like you can't just get it's on a, a diet. Life. It's yeah. a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. Change. Yeah, it really so, is. Like I and I was doing the supplements alone, like just over the counter stuff or stuff that different guys were trying, um, and there was really no regimen to it. It's just like, oh, what do you do for this, or what do you do for gain muscle, or oh, I take BCAAs, or I do this for recovery and this and that. And it's like I just need to go to a place where they can put me on an actual regimen mm -hmm. that literally addresses my issues right. like, because my issues aren't the same as someone else. Someone right. else may have issues with like they gain weight and lose weight real quick. I don't mm -hmm. do that, but mm -hmm. I do want to stay lean. Obviously being on television in a multitude of different ways, I want to stay, you know, looking young as much well, as I can. Well, I mean, can. you're constantly in the spotlight. Yeah, yeah. Always, you know, we know that feeling. On, always in public, public speaking, mm -hmm. traveling here and there to speak, to work with kids, to do stuff in the communities, charity, etc. Um, you know, the waiting room ain't gonna help that. You know no, what I'm saying? Sure. It's gonna, yeah. Um, you gotta be on point. Yeah, yeah. And, you gotta be on uh, point. Just, you know, having been on my, my therapies and my regimen with Titan gives me an opportunity to like be sharp mm -hmm. all the time. Mm -hmm. 
And in the business that I'm in, I have to be sharp all the time. It's like true. one thing that you're not, one moment you're not sharp, yeah. and you could lose a lot of stuff. <laughs> oh, you know? yeah. Just oh, yeah. And this is even, even just from a speaking standpoint, if I get up there and I'm dragging and. Or mm, even a know, stutter. Yeah, you know. Um, and it's okay to stutter because we stutter in normal conversation. Right? Yeah. But it's like if you are like trying to, if you're you're like foggy and you're trying to give this inspirational speech, it's not going to work. <laughs> right. you know I mean? um, yeah, you got to be on it for yeah. sure. So, you be you on know, it. that's that's uh, and like I said, I would encourage any and everybody like. Not just because I'm I'm doing Titan, but I, obviously many others are doing it. They've been doing very well for a reason. It works. Um, and but. What what I may be what I may have needed, you may not need, mm -hmm. and vice versa. What you need, I may not need. Right. But the the the, the real to, yeah the real key to it is is coming here to see exactly what you need. Like, and you're not going to get that reading on the internet. You're not going to get that scrolling through Instagram. Oh, buy this or <laughs> shop now or do this. No, you know, uh, no, no, um, no, no. Yeah, they they everything they've done has been. I mean, the equivalent to going to a doctor's office, they actually have doctors here that will take your blood and sit down with you and go over your blood results and tell you like everything that you're lacking in, if it's iron, if it's vitamin D, if it's whatever, mm -hmm. your estrogen level's too high, your testosterone is too low, all these things, you know, and then there's other like ailments that you can come to them with that they can't diagnose through a blood test. So you mm -hmm. say, hey man, I've been really having an issue with my left knee. Or my I was just gonna say that shoulder. too. You know, yeah, like I know you've had some prior injuries, yeah. and, and it's like and we offer stuff, some things for that too. Yeah, that stuff is like, what can I do to help me with recovery? Uh, hey, I just had surgery, mm -hmm. um, or I have a friend that just had surgery. I'm gonna send them to you guys because you guys helped me get well and help yeah. me recover faster. Um, like, what are these things that are um, going to not only accelerate the healing process, but also like to your point you said earlier, give us an opportunity to make things a part of a lifestyle. Right. right? Like it's not a quick fix thing. You don't just come here and be like, "Oh, I'm gonna give it two months." Yeah. Well, everybody looks for the instant yeah, yeah, gratification. Yeah, 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 you know, yeah, yeah. everybody's really looking that. for it. And I mean, if you're putting in the work, mm -hmm. you'll get more gratification yeah. faster than you would if yeah. you weren't putting in the work. Correct. But yeah. it really is a lifestyle change. Yeah. You know, you yeah. gotta just tighten up on. Me personally, I mean, I'll, I'll be the first one to say, like, I, I love food too. Mm -hmm. I do. And I, when I work hard, I almost justify that, that Chick-fil-A, you know, yeah. I justify that Chick-fil-A and I justify Make those sure nuggets. Pay her for that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do. I'm like, this is justified. I'm going to yeah. eat all these nuggets. It's going to be so good. Yeah. But you know, obviously throughout the week, I try to make smarter choices, you know, and eat properly because it's not just about looks at that point, right? right? We're yeah. talking about internally. Yeah. It can cause, you know, with high salt intake, mm -hmm. that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. It can cause high blood pressure, yeah. you know, high inflammation. cholesterol, yeah. inflammation, inflammation throughout the body. Yeah. Yeah. So we're talking about internally as well, because you can look good all day. Mm -hmm. It's not just about looking good. Mm -hmm. It's about being healthy and about extending your life as long as you possibly can. Mm -hmm. And feeling good. Yeah. I mean, we're in preventative medicine right yeah. now. You know, yeah. I've been in the medical field for 20 years. Mm. Jeez, I don't want to stamp the, my age here, but, um, yeah, we, 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 yeah, we, this is, you, know, you see, I, didn't 20, see, see, I thought you was 20 years old. I was going to say, I, I mean, y'all did, did not know I was 81. Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I look good for 81, yeah, right? I'm rocking right. it. I'm saying. So. <laughs> no wonder John, she, John can't get rid of it. She can't get rid of John. That's no, right. he ain't going yeah. nowhere. He ain't going nowhere. <laughs> He ain't going nowhere, but I mean, you know, it's, and I'm 200 years old. It's, yeah, he, yeah, I got a lock and key on that one <laughs> right there. So, but it's, you listen, it, it is important, you know, and back in the day, it was always about, okay, let's, and I'm sure, you know, too, you know, when you back, back in the day when you had to go to the doctor's. It was like, all right, let's wait for something to be broken and then we're going to fix it. Right. But now, you know, it's 2023 yeah. and you can actually prevent it from mm -hmm. happening. Mm -hmm. Or let's just say you start to see the beginning of diabetes part, you know, mm -hmm. type two, mm -hmm. and you're like, okay, wait, I have to make some changes. Mm -hmm. You start making changes to your, your diet, start making changes to what's going on and possibly get on some therapies that can get that number mm -hmm. down, your hemoglobin A1C. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, it's a game changer, you know, it's a game changer. So if you could be preventative about your health, why not go the extra mile and be preventative so that you can live a longer and a happier life. Especially people that like, like I have, you know, three kids, two sons and, um, 
and my daughter. Who, my daughter's adopted, but um, I always look at like how am I how am I going to be able to maximize my time on Earth with my kids? Mm-hmm. Yeah. like I love running mm-hmm. around with my kids, playing basketball with my kids. Yeah. Uh, they will run circles around me now yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, because they've gotten older and they're twice as athletic as I am right at the moment. But to be able to do that, you know, you gotta you gotta have the proper Everything, like you say to your point, preventative. And some people that, like, there are certain things that, that run in my family mm-hmm. that I'm trying to avoid. Of you know, course. diabetes right. being one of them. Of course. Yeah. And in order to, you know, try to main, not only maintain this lifestyle, but keep keep it on a pace that, like, my kids will see the, how I live my life and what I do to kind of take care of myself and mm-hmm. take care of my body. And like, hopefully, it. yeah, they can mirror, mirror that. Like, hey, dad, you know, that's you know, 40 something years old, yeah. I'll say something because I don't <laughs> Trust me, I'm right there with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, uh, but, he, but he looks, he looks great. You know, yeah. he looks young and it, he's vibrant and he's got, you know, energy and yeah. every time he goes into a room, yeah. it's like the whole energy of the room goes up yeah. and stuff like that. Like I want to, I want to ha- have that as long as I'm on earth. Of course. Yeah. I can't do that on my own. Yeah. You know, I know for a fact I can't do that on my own. Trust me. Because I'm, I'm going to be eating and chilling and going to different events and doing all this stuff. This you event. got a lot going on yeah. for sure. Yeah. And, and I, I like, you know, I, I think mental health is, uh, mental health counseling is important. Of course. Yep. I, of course. I go to, uh, uh, to the gym. It's yeah. Going is important. Is important. I take yoga now. It's important. Oh, wow. But all that stuff is like, counterproductive if you don't have the right supplementation. I agree. Yeah. I mean, when we talk about mental health, right? Mm-hmm. So I was just doing a thing about this in my live the other day that they did a study and people that had depression, mm-hmm. instead of taking depression medication, they actually ran it with, with doing exercise. Mm-hmm. And it was 42% more effective mm-hmm. than depression, than uh, that. anti, you know, uh, depressants if they're taking them. Yeah. So right. it's, it's really, really cool mm-hmm. to see that. Um, but leading into that, hormones. Mm. So there's a lot of guys mm. out there, or girls. And girls, yeah. They start feeling down, mm. and they've got everything going for them, right? Mm. They've got all the money in the world, the relationship's good, their kids mm. are good. And they're like, what's wrong? Right? Mm. And they just feel down. They don't yeah. know why. Yeah. And, you know, if they go into a general practitioner, sometimes they'll go there and tell them this, and guys especially, and they, they talk about how they don't feel so good anymore about themselves, and like, self-confidence is down, and even the bedroom, the libido is down too as well. Mm. And usually those general practitioners, they don't run a blood test on them. Mm-hmm. They just put them on antidepressants. Mm-hmm. They put them on you know, Viagra or whatever mm-hmm. it may be. The quick fix the band-aid. Right? And it, it cures the symptoms yeah. to a certain extent. Or it might make them worse or yeah. they just don't get over the depression portion. But testosterone, I mean, we're talking about receptors in the brain. Mm-hmm. At that point, that could help a lot of patients out mm-hmm. maybe feeling better. We know mm-hmm. that's going to bring self-confidence. Um, it's going to make them feel better all the way around. Mm-hmm. And at that point, you know, we want people to feel good mm-hmm. on the inside yeah. and the yeah. outside. Yeah. Yeah. It's not just about the outside. Yeah. So, yeah. And that's a lot of people like, I mean, we see it on Instagram all the time, you know, people getting surgeries and I'm not yeah. against you doing whatever you want to do to right. your body. Right. But like that alone is not going to no. do anything for you on the inside. No. Mm-hmm. And it's really not going to do much for you on the outside because you still got maintenance with that stuff. Of too. course. Right. Of course. Right. But if you, if you're going to spend all that money on a surgery, follow up with it. At least do your best to, uh, to, 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 I mean, Change. cause you, you've gone through all this pain. Like I've seen some of the videos yeah. of people that have got certain yeah. things done. Oh man. It's like, you know, <laughs> yeah, those BBLs all. are crazy. Yeah, 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 like yeah, so yeah, long. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, I mean so. I'm seeing, I'm seeing people that get it done and then they've been patient. I mean, remember we've been open for 11 yeah, years. Yeah. So we've had some patients yeah, on yeah. with us for 10 years, yeah. nine years, whatever yeah. it is. See them get the surgery done, not make the changes that they should make, yeah. and then come back to us yeah. saying, yeah. "I need a quick fix because yeah, 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 yeah. this is yeah. what happened." And I'm yeah. like, "Listen, we can give it to you all day, but I'm telling you, yeah. you're going to have the yo-yo effect, yeah. and you're going to continue having the yo-yo effect until you decide that you want to make those changes." Yeah. Yeah. You know, and it does not all have to be at one time either. Mm-hmm. You know, you don't have to say, "All right, I'm going to quit," all, you know, all this alcohol. I'm going to quit everything. I'm going to quit all the fast food. I'm going to go to the gym every day at seven o'clock in the morning. I'm working out for two hours. It doesn't. Mm-hmm. It doesn't need to be that aggressive. Mm-hmm. I mean, you could literally just start somewhere. I mean, yeah. it, it, start somewhere by walking. Walk your dog. Mm-hmm. Go outside. Mm-hmm. You know, um, I, me personally, I'm busy. 
I do work probably about 15 hours a day. Mm. And, you know, that's in between the baseballs coming yeah. between my ears mm -hmm. with my kid. Yeah. So, you know, it is what it is. And I have to balance it out, you know, and John's coaching and yeah. I just, there's so much going on. So, you know, but the minute I get it, like, okay, maybe I got like 50 emails I got to check. Mm. All right, let me go get on, you know, the treadmill real quick mm. and at least walk. Mm. So you see, you got to maximize your time and be smart about it and really have time management because mm. anybody that ever says that they don't have time, and when you start breaking down how many hours are actually in the day, if you if you put it together properly, you can you make time. Time, time you management. Time. You can make time. Yeah. You can. Yeah. It's a matter of yeah. whether or not you want to make time and what you prioritize at that it's point. True. Or what you're forced to make time yeah. for. Or what you're forced yeah. to make time and, for. Yeah. In regards to health, you see a lot of people that are making decisions about their health because they're forced to, not because they want to. Right. Mm -hmm. right. And um, you know, the thing that I've, I've always wanted to make sure that, that I do is always not have to be forced to do it. Right. Not have to be forced to address it. Right. So staying on top of that stuff, um, whether you're exercising every day or two days a week or, or even one day a week, like you manage that by the way you eat mm -hmm. and then what type of, you know, regimen, therapy regimen that you're doing. Right. Um, cause I've seen people that, that I've seen, they look phenomenal. I'm like, man, you must be in the gym, like, yeah. you know, all the time, yeah. <laughs> five, <laughs> seven days a week, this and that. <laughs> it's like, no, actually, I work out, I, I do weights one time a week, mm -hmm. I do yoga twice a week, oh, wow. I do boxing once a week, and I'm good. Yeah. And I'm, I'm like, two of them are clients of y'all, so. Oh, wow. I'm nice. like, oh, that's awesome. I'm like, how, that. how, uh, how. I, I want to get to that yeah. point, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, like, I got it all wrong, yeah. It's, can you send me that, that the workout part and how you, when you do boxing yeah. and when you do this and when you do that? And so I've actually tried to mirror that some. But um, the the real key for me, I, I believe, is like just being disciplined on my regimen. Mm -hmm. Like, I know I'm not going to be disciplined on my food mm -hmm. unless I'm forced mm -hmm. to get disciplined mm -hmm. on my food. Mm -hmm. Right. I, if I wake up one morning and I don't feel like going to the gym, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, some sure. people, you know, if I if I don't, because our bodies need rest too. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Sleep to, is mean, imperative. I used to Recovery. just be like, you know, I gotta fight through it. I gotta yeah. get up. I gotta fight through it. Yeah. Nah, bro. I ain't trying to impress nobody. Yeah. I'm trying to live. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, 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 you yeah, want yeah. a happy I'm life. Fight, yeah. You know, you want to enjoy. If I gotta it. fight through it. Yeah. It means I don't even need to do it. No, yeah. I agree. It's just like, you know, posting something on social media. Yeah. If I got to think about it, yeah. I probably shouldn't up. post it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 If I got to think, well, you know, I wonder if this. Uh, yeah, How should I, uh, I mean, what should I do? Yeah. You know, just forget about it. And recovery is key. A lot of people forget about that. Yeah. And it's yeah. like, you know, you don't want to train seven days a week. You need mm. a day or two mm. off to mm. let your body repair itself. Yeah. Um, when we talk about sleep, that's an important key role. And, you know, as we are all busy mm -hmm. here, they're sitting here really busy. Very, yes. um, it's hard to get that good amount of eight hours in. You know, mm -hmm. I mean, I'm getting six to maybe eight. And Sharice is uh, maybe a little less. Yeah. yeah. Um, but I'm with you. It's, you know, that's <laughs> I haven't. I, I don't. I couldn't tell you the last time I got eight hours. Yeah, I mean, it's been a long time for me. And it's I just, mean, it's people just, always you know, ask me. You know, man, I see you on social media. You here? You there? You this yeah. and that? Do you ever sleep? I'll be like, yeah, I take cat nap. Yeah, yeah right? on the plane. Yeah. I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> You gotta get the Sometimes plane. not even You're there. not even playing. Yeah. So you're sitting next to somebody who wants yeah. to talk to you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah you know, I know what it is to, to not get that sleep and then have to perform the next mm -hmm. day. I mean, because mm -hmm. we got responsibilities and there's no taking days off. Mm -hmm. I mean, even if, you have, even if you have to fight through it some days, it sucks, but mm -hmm. it is what it is. Mm -hmm. But repairing muscle goes in sleep, right? And that's when we need recovery. So at that point, you want to try to get sleep because that's a positive change in your lifestyle too as well. Let me, um, let, me ask, let me ask you this question. I'm just for both of y'all. So sure. like we're all around the same age. Yeah. Um, she's not. She's I mean, like she's five not, years. She's 21. She's yeah, yeah, she's 21. Okay. She's just clarify that yeah, real quick. 21, <laughs> yeah. Um, so <laughs> if you had one therapy, mm -hmm. and this is for each one of you, if you had one therapy that like you say, I, there's no way I cannot have this as part of my regimen. What would it be? It would be HRT for me. Mm -hmm. Testosterone replacement. If you need it, yeah. that is the, the, the life changer. Mm -hmm. right? Everything else helps in other ways. You know, you got semi-glutide for weight loss, yeah. curbing appetite, Hercules potion for pump and all. But without your hormones in check mm -hmm. and optimized, mm -hmm. I, I think that's, that's a loser. Mm -hmm. uh, and you can 
do different things. Like, let's say you need to cover up with energy. You can yeah. take energy drinks and all yeah, this, yeah, yeah. but it's not the best way to do it. Mm-hmm. If you can get the natural feeling, and, and I believe that's it, that's the key to anti-aging. Mm-hmm. Because as we age, mm-hmm. those hormones all decline. Mm-hmm. And I, I always bring it back to the example of a flower. We grow, we bloom, we wither, we die. Mm-hmm. So it's the exact same thing. We're on a, we're on a decline, a default, mm-hmm. and everything starts going down with it. Mm-hmm. So if you can turn back the clock internally, that's when you'll feel better on the outside and inside, uh, you know, and feel like you're at a younger age. You know, I mean, that's that's what the body's doing. It's basically replenishing what it doesn't have and it's bringing it back to optimal levels. And that's what your body usually is in this prime. So if we can bring it back to those prime levels and everything dialed in like that, you know, I think I think that's the, uh, that would to me would be my pick. John definitely needs testosterone. Okay, guys, for many reasons. Let's make sure John gets his testosterone <laughs> on time. <laughs> well, because I want you know, listen, he's a little, he, uh, it's, seems a little aggressive. <laughs> I'm not aggressive at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more or less, you know, like because he's got so much to do, and you know, we're business partners. Mm. So I, I, I mean, he's, he's point. I gotta have him that's like I gotta have him like going. Yeah. You know, it's like because I'm constantly going. My yeah. my therapy would be the ECAs. Okay. Um, That's a good one too. I, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to be without it. And the reason why is because I'll be honest, because I'm brutally honest all the time. Um, I don't get a chance to work out. Like I very, very seldomly, I, if it is, it realistically once a week and it's for 20 or 30 minutes and I get, then I get pulled away to do something else. But the ECAs, yeah, I mean, cause I'm not, cause I'm not making time. time. Yeah. I'm not, I'm yeah. like, is it sleep? It is. is it sleep or is it working out? I'm like, I'm going to sleep. Yeah. So, you know, or it might be dinner. Work on your, your time it might be management. dinner, you know, I'm, I'm work on that time management yeah. for sure. I go, you know, you gotta get these girls next door, man. I'm telling you, yeah. you gotta get them under control. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The staff yeah. gotta get under control now so yeah. I can get a little time. Yeah. But, um, you know, in the bigger scheme of things, it's worth it. But the ECAs, Honestly, I'm, I'm even on my worst day where I only get like two hours of sleep. Mm-hmm. If I get up and I take that, I'm usually off to the races. Mm-hmm. And not only that, you know, obviously for the girls, you know, me particularly, I like to stay skinny. So it keeps me nice and lean and, you know, it's a, it's a prescription thermogenic. So it constantly is burning fat no matter what I'm doing, whether I'm sitting at a desk yeah, or I'm around. I was about to around. say, can you, like, explain so i know what it is yeah i know it's about like, ECA. so yep, it's a, ECA, yep, know it's a ephedrine caffeine aspirin b12 and chromium and it's all in one capsule mm-hmm. so you know sometimes you because back in the day the i'm sure white, every, white pill. yeah what's that the blue and white pill. well there's different doses oh there's just yeah. there's different dosages mm-hmm. for di- different tolerances mm-hmm. right because i have a lower tolerance to caffeine and i don't want to be jittery i don't want heart palpitations or any of that so we have a high dose and a low dose. Mm-hmm. So most people take the high dose, but me personally, I do take the low dose. Um, but you know, with that combination, some people get those over the counter fat burners, right? Mm-hmm. And when you go and get the over the counter fat burners, cause I remember taking these back in the day before any of this ECA came mm-hmm. along, right? Mm-hmm. Um, you just don't know what you're getting. Yeah. You have no idea what you're putting in your body mm-hmm. and nobody's regulating it. So anybody can put together a bottle of sugar and call it the best, you know, fat burning pill you'll ever see in your life. And then you're just taking it. Yeah. Next thing you know, kidney functions might be messed up. Liver enzymes might be high. You know, maybe you do end up with some heart issues, that kind of stuff. So heart palpitations, anxiety, jitteriness. I mean, these are common because yeah, they, you don't want that. They stack all these different components in there that are supposed to be stimulants. Mm proprietary blends and all these other yeah. things. And then you don't know what you're getting, yeah. you know? So, I mean, that that one right there is a lifesaver for me. I mean, yeah. definitely want a lifesaver. Yes. You know, flipping, flipping the switch here, because I was going to ask you the same thing. Mm-hmm. Um, I was going to say, like, you know, because I know you do take a lot of therapies from Titan. Mm-hmm. So, and I'm sure it's changed in many different aspects of your life. But if you had to pick two of your favorite therapies, mm-hmm. which ones would they be? Uh, BPC-157. I knew you were going to say that. Uh, for the injuries. For, yeah, injuries, healing recovery, healing recovery, peptide. healing peptide. And then uh, probably glutathione. Oh, oh wow. okay. Yeah. That's um, a key. I was going to say NAD. NAD is another NAD's one. NAD is a big yeah. one, man. Yeah. That's a huge one. That's yeah. a big one. Anti-aging, energy, and mental focus. clarity. Focus. Yeah. 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 Probably, yeah. If I, yeah. I mean, it's be between glutathione and NAD. Uh, if I yeah. had to pick three, it would definitely be BPC-157 would be the... Top one, then 
toss up between NAB yeah. and glutathione. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the glutathione for you, I think, would be really important because of all the travel. Yes. And, you know, not only that, but with your injuries mm -hmm. comes inflammation. Mm -hmm. And glutathione helps with inflammation of the body. Yeah. So it's kind of hitting different yeah. categories. I knew you would say one of the healing peptides, yeah. too, because of the multiple yeah. injuries that you Preventive have. for traveling, too, yeah. as well, being around a whole yeah. bunch of people. Yeah. yeah. So, um, yeah. yeah, well, Thaddeus, we don't want to take too much of your time. We know you're busy, mm -hmm. um, but we appreciate you coming by. Right. Yeah. As always, we great seeing you, you, man. We love, we love you. you very much, man. We do Thank love you. you. Okay. Up always face support always us. be smooth. <laughs> I need to get what I need to get some more, like a, a higher dose, so I can look like, <laughs> super young. Right. I need to get something that'll keep me from graying, but I don't think y'all have that. Oh, man, I don't know me. about that. As soon yeah. as I find that, I, I mean, I got it too. Right? You got me a couple growing in, but every time I see it, I'm like, uh-uh. Yeah, yeah. I pull it right out. Yeah, I got it right out. Man, that just helps me. <laughs> Once I get that, it's on for sure. You guys understand though, right? Just for the record, that you know, the the the, the couple grays, guys, it's a good look. Yeah, on occasion. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so yeah. we're gonna see here with a couple grays. We'll yeah, tell you the same see, thing. Right? I said I'm the same. Hey, Sharice, it's a good look. <laughs> it looks, it looks Why good. Why would you take it out? It's that awesome. Bad. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> uh, we appreciate uh, it, guys. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching the interview with, with Titan. Thaddeus O'Neill, right? Um, so we appreciate it. Thaddeus. Right, thank you. Thank you as always, man. All right, yeah. man. Thank you. Thank you, always guys. See you guys soon. Tighten out. <laughs>